Hello Capricorn, welcome to your June reading for your oracle cards this month. From the House of Night deck, you've pulled the moon. Now the moon speaks about intuition, that inner wisdom, that gut instinct that we all have. And when you pull the moon, it suggests that your intuition is very strong right now. And it asked me to pull out another card to clarify what you needed to be <clears throat> use your intuition about and I pulled obedience for you now this card suggests that there may be either you or someone in your midst may be tempted to break some kind of rule now this could be a rule of society can be a rule of a home a relationship I feel with this card it it's, speaks more about perhaps someone wanting to be rebellious in some way and from the angels deck you've pulled notice the signs so again this speaks about intuition so these three cards together Capricorn to me suggest that there's a need for you to keep your eyes open and Keep your senses on high alert, I feel, for something, someone who seems to want to be rebellious and a rule breaker, I sense, with these. So let's see where this takes us, Capricorn. Right in the centre of your reading, you have the King of Cups. Now, I feel that this is your energy rather than another person you're not a water sign but I'm picking you up as someone right now and this can go either way male or female because this is a general reading I'm picking you up as someone who is seeking to be emotionally fulfilled I feel that you're taking a calm approach with this card I also sense that you're a very loving very compassionate caring person so let's see what else I can pull up for you for the overall energy of the month of the King of Cups for Capricorn what is this King of Cups about for Capricorn oh we have the Ace of Cups and one more the star so this is good energy for you Capricorn. It seems that your focus is very much on emotion <clears throat> because we have the King of Cups and the Ace of Cups. I think you are on the lookout with the star because I feel like you have a lot of hope and faith here in the future of being offered some kind of new love opportunity here. This can also suggest renewal of a, a love relationship. But I sense more so with this card with the, Ace of, with the Ace of Cups and the King of Cups. I feel this is more you wanting something entirely new. A, a brand new potential for, for love. And, and you've got a lot of hope here with the Star card. So let's see where this takes us. Capricorn I really like that that that's your overall energy seems very positive so let's see what's happened in the past okay Capricorn I feel this is you as an earth sign you're coming up as the queen of pentacles in reverse again can be male or female when you're in reverse I, I feel that there's some something you haven't been able to trust whether it's yourself or someone else maybe not being able to trust a situation there may be some insecurity about something as well so let's see what else I can pull out on the Queen of Pentacles in reverse because you're normally a very grounded person but I feel very stable very very capable so I feel that when you're in reverse something here has left you feeling ungrounded not stable so let's see what else I can pull out okay you've got the four of wands I'm going to pull out one more for you 
the Three of Cups. So I feel like there was a, a celebration in the past. It may have involved a marriage or a long-term commitment because I often see the Four of Wands as a marriage card. I feel like there was some kind of stability that you had in the past. It, it, was, it was a commitment and I feel there was a celebration around it. So that's why I feel that this was a wedding in the past. But for some reason, it didn't make you happy. It, it left you being, I feel you were insecure in the situation. You were not able to trust in this marriage. There may have been some betrayals or it really could have been anything that led you not to be able to trust in, in this relationship, I feel. I get a deep sense of you having gone through a, a, a ceremony in the past but I feel that it's, it's left you feeling insecure and not on stable ground. So let's see where this takes us, Capricorn. In your current energy, you have the Five of Pentacles in reverse. So this isn't bad for you, Capricorn. This to me speaks about a turning point. I feel like something in the past has left you feeling perhaps isolated, lonely. I feel there was a situation that there may have been some financial loss as well with a past commitment, I feel. But the good news is that you're in the reverse here with the Five of Pentacles. And I feel that this is you emerging from struggles, from an in, emerging from an intense, difficult time in your life. So that's good news. So I'd like to find out what else is going on with that Five of Pentacles in reverse for your Capricorn. You have the Page of Cups. So it suggests to me that there is a new offer coming in or an offer from someone. Again, can be someone, it can be a renewal as well, but it can also be a brand new offer. It is the page, so it, it can be someone who, it, perhaps coming from someone who is, has a younger energy. They may be slightly immature as well, being a page. But the pages are often messen messengers. And I feel that this love offer that's coming through, it's, it seems positive because it, it's, it's coming, it's allowing you to exit this period of your life I feel where you felt very isolated so let's see what your future energy is Capricorn you have the Queen of Swords in reverse now this can be you or, or someone else it can be an air sign male or female that's a Libra Gemini or Aquarius now this person is coming up in the reverse so there's something not making them happy they may be disappointed. They may be often the Queen of Swords. If, if they don't, if they do get disappointed in their decisions or, or in love, they can become quite bitter. And they can be they can be quite cold and detached as well. So let's see what else I can pull up. On that energy there for the future for you Capricorn you have the six of wands so I feel this is not your energy Capricorn I feel this is someone around you and it seems that someone has wanted to achieve some kind of victory they wanted some kind of recognition or it, it can also mean validation. They wanted some kind of triumph or success. 
and it seems because they're in the reverse that they have they've been disappointed with being able to with this with this victory or success so we'll see where that one goes i will clarify this for you in the comprehensive which i will have up on my vimeo channel and you can click on the link below in the descriptions box for that i'll be doing an extended reading of this june reading for you capricorn now in your advice you have the two of pentacles and as your advice capricorn that's a a warning for you to take your time when making a decision weigh up the options before you make a decision really list out the pros and cons i feel before making a a, a big decision so let's see what else i can pull out on the two of pentacles for you capricorn Capricorn you have the four of swords it's in reverse now this is suggesting that you're coming out of a time of rest and recuperation I feel like you're getting your spirit back you're getting your passion back and you're wanting to to get out and experience life more I feel with the four of swords in reverse and this is you getting back out there getting back on onto the getting yourself back on the socializing scene so i feel that this is an option that you're weighing out and again i'll be clarifying more of the advice in my in my extended reading on my vimeo channel now as your environment you have the four of pentacles so there is something stable and secure that either you or someone else wants to to hold on to i feel they don't want to let something go so let's see what else i can pull out on the four of pentacles for you capricorn you have the chariot and one more the king of swords so I feel that this King of Swords is someone in your in your environment. I feel it's most likely the same person here that's coming up as this air sign in reverse as your future energy. Now here they're in the upright, but this is your present energy. This is something that's going on in your environment that's affecting you currently, Capricorn. Air sign, male or female, again, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. And I feel this King of Swords is not wanting to let something go i feel that it's a stable secure relationship perhaps it's it's this one that was in the past here that you have up here where you're not trusting of the situation and i feel with the chariot card here they're they're wanting to control this situation that they, they've the king of swords is a very decisive person it's it's someone who is acting with authority conviction they're sure that they're right that they're correct and i feel that they're making a decision here capricorn to hold on to this stable secure relationship and maybe i feel that that is what is being offered here with this page of cups in your current energy capricorn where you're coming out of this period of isolation it, it could have been that this person that you and this person were taking a break i feel but i feel they're coming back around now because they're not able to to let this stable secure relationship go so let's see what's in your hopes and fears capricorn you have the seven of wands so this is an energy here of you holding your ground against competition defending yourself facing a challenge i feel like you're protecting something so let's see what else i can pull out for you on that seven of wands capricorn 
as your hopes and or fears and you have the fool card so I feel that this is a hope of yours Capricorn with the fool I feel that this is your energy I feel that you may be wanting to take a new approach here start fresh I feel on a new journey and that's what I'm picking up here right in the center with this star card and the ace of cups and you coming up as the king of cups I feel that you're wanting you have a lot of hope for new love something brand new is how I feel and I feel that this is you protecting protecting yourself here because I feel like you're you're standing up for what you believe in and I, and I feel you want to take this new journey here this new set out on this new adventure is how I'm feeling with these cards Capricorn so let's see how this plays out in your outcome you have the Queen of Wands so I feel that this is your energy even though you're not a fire sign I feel you're coming up as being very a very confident person someone who is able to tackle new challenges someone who likes adventure travel someone who wants to experience they're very very capable I feel can also mean something new in terms of you wanting to take a new direction with with the Queen of Wands is often a creative person someone who is able to handle tackling new challenges like opening a a business or anything that involves leadership so I feel that this is, is this is your energy right now so let's see what else I can pull up for you here Capricorn you have the strength card <clears throat> so I feel that this is definitely your energy you're coming out here in the outcome as being quite courageous I, I feel I feel you you you're wanting to take this new direction here with the fool card and you're standing your ground because I feel that you haven't been able to trust in this past commitment I feel with this king of swords but they seem to be coming in right now not wanting to lose their, their, their security and stability and I see them making an offer here to you in in the present energy but here in the in the future energy I see them as being disappointed because they've wanted to they've wanted to be successful but I, I don't feel that they have because you're coming up here in the outcome as being quite confident and with the with the inner strength to to move forward on on what you are wanting to achieve here which I feel is you wanting something brand new or to start a new adventure here with the fool and the ace of cups so I'm going to clarify all of these for you in the comprehensive which I'm going to put up on Vimeo and the link for that is in my descriptions box below so I hope to see you there I'll be putting up an, a, a 25 minute video where I'll be uh, extending this reading so we can find out exactly what's going to happen here but I feel that it has to do with you using your intuition noticing the signs I, I feel that there may be something with this king of swords where you're not able to trust them I feel because you're coming up here as the queen of pentacles in reverse which leads me to believe that there's something you're not able to trust in in this relationship so I want to clarify what that is what it is exactly that you're wanting to move on to your advice which is your best path to follow of how to achieve what you are looking to uh, to do here which I feel is a new start and I also want to find out what's going to happen with this king of swords 
where it seems that they're going to be disappointed in some way. So that's your reading for June Capricorn. I hope to see you on my Vimeo channel for the extended reading. Please stay tuned and I will let you know how to contact me for a personal reading if this has particularly resonated with you. And I will speak to you again very soon. All the best of luck with this Capricorn. Bye for now. Hello everyone, it's Michelle from Gypsy Insights. I'm an intuitive reader. I receive the energies from the cards as I read them. I'm here to provide guidance through tarot and I hope that you enjoy the readings. My general readings can be quite specific and won't resonate with everyone. Please check your sun, moon and rising signs to see which one resonates the most with you. And remember, the energies can resonate with you or go vice versa. These general readings are provided free of charge, so if you are enjoying my readings, please feel free to donate using PayPal and my email address, gypsyinsights at gmail.com. I look forward to reading for you personally. Please email me at gypsyinsights at gmail.com if you would like a personal reading. Please like, share and subscribe. I'll be adding additional content on a regular basis. Thanks again for watching. I really appreciate your support and I will see you again very soon.